Deep within the Amazon rainforest, a secret simmers, hidden from the eyes of the world. Hidden by dense foliage and ancient trees, a river flows unlike any other, a river that defies the natural order. This is not a place for the faint of heart. The very air around it seems to hum with an otherworldly energy. This is Shane Timpishka, the Boiling River, a phenomenon that has puzzled scientists and mystics alike. Legend whispers of its existence, a river so hot it seems to defy the laws of nature. Locals speak of its power with reverence and fear, their voices tinged with awe and respect. It is a place of myth and mystery, where the earth itself seems to boil, creating an almost surreal landscape. For centuries, stories of the boiling river have captivated the imagination, drawing in explorers and adventurers. Tales passed down through generations speak of a river so hot it could scald the flesh from your bones, a natural wonder that commands respect, a place where shamans drew upon the earth's energy, performing rituals that connected them to the spirit world, a place where the veil between worlds thinned, allowing for a deeper connection to the mysteries of the universe. Is it merely folklore? Or does the reality of Shanae Tempishka surpass even the wildest legends? The truth may be more extraordinary than we can imagine. The journey to Shane Tempishka is not for the faint of heart. The path is winding and treacherous, cutting through dense jungle trails that seem almost impenetrable. Every step forward feels like a step into another world, a world where nature reigns supreme. It lies deep within the Peruvian Amazon, in a region known as the Mayantuyaku Sanctuary. This sanctuary is a hidden gem, a place where the modern world feels a million miles away, and the ancient rhythms of the earth can still be felt. This protected area is a haven for biodiversity, teeming with life in its many forms. From the smallest insects to the largest mammals, every creature plays a role in this intricate web of life. The forest is alive, a symphony of sounds and movements that never ceases. Towering trees form an emerald canopy overhead, filtering the sunlight that reaches the forest floor. The light dances through the leaves, creating a mosaic of shadows and highlights that is ever-changing, ever-beautiful. The air hangs heavy with humidity, alive with the sounds of insects and the calls of exotic birds. Each breath feels thick and rich, filled with the essence of the rainforest. The atmosphere is both oppressive and invigorating, a constant reminder of the power of nature. But beneath the vibrant tapestry of life, a primal force stirs. The ground beneath your feet feels almost alive, as if the earth itself is breathing, pulsing with an ancient energy. The earth itself bears the scars of ancient geological activity. These formations tell a story of a world in constant flux, shaped by forces beyond our control or comprehension. Volcanic vents release plumes of steam, a constant reminder of the fiery heart that beats beneath the surface. These vents are like windows into the earth's soul, revealing the raw power that lies just below. It is here, amidst this unique confluence of life and geothermal activity, that we find the legendary Boiling River. This river is a marvel of nature, a place where water and fire coexist, creating a landscape that is both beautiful and dangerous. The Boiling River is a testament to the incredible forces that shape our world, a reminder of the power and mystery of the Earth. For the Ashaninka people, the indigenous guardians of this land, their connection to nature is profound and deeply spiritual. Shane Tempishka is more than just a river. It is the lifeblood of their culture and a symbol of their enduring heritage. It is a sacred site, steeped in tradition and shrouded in myth, where the physical and spiritual worlds intertwine. Their legend tells of a giant serpent spirit, Yakumama, the mother of the waters who is both protector and destroyer. She is said to reside within the depths of the earth, her fiery breath giving rise to the boiling waters of the river, a phenomenon that has fascinated scientists and mystics alike. According to the Ashaninka, the river's heat is a manifestation of Yakumama's power, a tangible reminder of her presence and influence. It is a place of both healing and danger, a place to be respected and revered, where the boundaries between the natural and supernatural blur. Shamans, the spiritual leaders of the Ashaninka, believe that the river's waters hold powerful healing properties, capable of curing ailments and restoring balance. They perform ancient rituals along its banks, seeking guidance and protection from the spirits of the forest, invoking the power of Yakumama to aid them in their quest for harmony and health. 
From a scientific perspective, the existence of a boiling river might seem like something out of a Jules Verne novel. However, the reality of Shanae Timpishka is no less fascinating. While the river doesn't quite reach a rolling boil, its temperature can reach a scorching 95 degrees Celsius, 203 degrees Fahrenheit. This intense heat is a result of geothermal activity. Unlike traditional hot springs, which are often localized phenomena, the heat source for Shanae Timpishka is far more extensive. The river sits atop a vast network of underground faults and fissures. These cracks in the Earth's crust allow superheated water to rise from deep within the Earth, creating the illusion of a river that boils. The geothermal activity that fuels Shanae Tempishka is a testament to the immense power that lies beneath our feet. Deep within the Earth's mantle, temperatures soar due to the decay of radioactive isotopes and residual heat from the planet's formation. This heat is not evenly distributed but concentrated in certain areas, creating hotspots of geothermal activity. In the case of Shane A. Timpishka, the river flows over one such hotspot. Rainwater seeps deep into the earth where it is superheated by the surrounding rock. This superheated water then rises to the surface through faults and fractures, creating the unique phenomenon of a near-boiling river. The extreme temperatures of Shanae Timpishka create a unique and challenging environment for life. While the scalding waters are inhospitable to most creatures, certain species have adapted to thrive in this seemingly hostile environment. These extremophiles, as they are known, demonstrate the remarkable tenacity and adaptability of life on Earth. Scientists have discovered a diverse array of thermophilic bacteria and other microorganisms thriving in the hot springs and vents that feed the river. These organisms have evolved unique adaptations that allow them to survive and even flourish in temperatures that would kill most other life forms. For generations, the Ashaninka people have lived in harmony with the rainforest, their lives intricately intertwined with the natural world. Their traditional knowledge, passed down through generations, holds valuable insights into the delicate balance of this unique ecosystem. They understand the importance of protecting the river and its surrounding forest. The Ashaninka believe that the river is a sacred gift, a source of both life and healing. They have long understood the importance of preserving the delicate balance of this unique ecosystem. Their traditional practices, such as sustainable harvesting and respect for the spirits of the forest, have helped to protect this sacred site for generations. The allure of the unknown has always captivated the human spirit, drawing explorers and adventurers to the farthest reaches of our planet. Shanae Timpishka, with its shroud of mystery and legend, is no exception. In recent years, the river has attracted increasing attention from scientists, explorers, and nature enthusiasts alike. Each expedition to Shanae Timpishka reveals new secrets, deepening our understanding of this unique ecosystem. Scientists are studying the river's geology, its unique biodiversity, and its potential for geothermal energy. Explorers are mapping its course, documenting its wonders, and sharing its story with the world. Shanae Timpishka stands as a powerful reminder of the awe-inspiring power and beauty of the natural world. It is a place where myth and science intersect, where ancient traditions meet modern understanding. Its existence challenges us to expand our perspectives, to appreciate the interconnectedness of all things, and to recognize the importance of preserving the delicate balance of our planet. The river's story is a call for greater understanding, for a deeper appreciation of the natural world and the indigenous cultures that have long been its stewards. It is a reminder that we have much to learn from these ancient cultures, from their wisdom, their respect for nature, and their deep understanding of the interconnectedness of all things. As we continue to explore and learn from Shanae Tempishka, it is imperative that we do so responsibly. The river and its surrounding rainforest are facing increasing threats from deforestation, pollution, and climate change. Protecting this unique ecosystem is not just about preserving a natural wonder. It is about safeguarding a vital part of our planet's biodiversity and cultural heritage. The future of Shanae Timpishka, like that of so many natural wonders, rests in our hands. By supporting conservation efforts, respecting indigenous knowledge, and promoting sustainable practices, we can help to ensure that this remarkable river continues to inspire and amaze generations to come. 
Let us strive to be worthy stewards of this planet, protecting its wonders and preserving its legacy for all who follow in our footsteps.